Well, it is almost time to go back to school for the kids and the change at home actually means your pets aren't going to have the company that they've really gotten used to over the summer and that change can really have an impact on them. So Anna Chrisman from Michigan Humane is here to share with us how to make this a little bit better of a transition for everybody. <laughs> we hope. We well, hope. thank you for coming in today and thank you for bringing in a new adorable pet that needs a home and our sponsor, the Mike Morris Law Firm, will pay the standard adoption fees for whoever adopts today's pet. And uh, we have an active friend joining us here we on Live do, in the D. We do, who also loves Hopi, in case you guys didn't <laughs> notice. Uh, so this is Destiny and Destiny here is about a year and a half old. Um, Definitely oh, an active exploratory cat. That's why actually <laughs> she's on her harness and leash today. Um, but she is looking for a family that can provide her with lots of attention. She is social cat in the extreme. Loves to meet people, loves to hang out. Mm -hmm. Clearly oh, hello. interested in microphones. Hello. <laughs> and she also um, is the type of cat who needs a lot of enrichment and a lot of stimulation as well. So if we are looking for a new home for her, um, ideally would go home adults kids could definitely integrate with other pets in the How home, no problems. Could definitely be introduced to other cats. She's a pretty easygoing gal, so anybody in the family is welcome to come and meet her. She is. I, I really sat down, and within 30 seconds, I know she was like, "This right is here. fine." Oh, this is cool. Yeah, yeah she's like, she right. like decided she wanted and to be in between fur, us. Her fur <laughs> is extremely soft. She is a sweetheart of a kitty cat, um, and she is definitely the type of cat who is honestly an easy install for most families if you've been thinking about getting a cat she would this be, would be the perfect first fit. cat absolutely yeah it seems like it well going back to school also what do you want families to consider as they make the transition especially for their pets too because you're at home you're getting to be around them so much and that change gone for most of the day now that's, that's a big adjustment. That's the huge adjustment. So the thing we're always encouraging pet parents to think about is in the same way we want to stagger kids schedules where we're you know backing up morning time, backing up the morning routine. Keep that in mind for your pets as well. So if you've got to change meal times, exercise times, make those changes gradual and start small. Start with 15 minute increment changes, 30 minute increment changes. Those are ideal. And make sure that you're still incorporating lots of quality time and play time for the animal as well. They're used to having us home during the summer. Mm -hmm. And so making sure that they still get the same level of attention during the school year is vital. And if you want a playful pet, uh, <laughs> Destiny right here would be the perfect <laughs> fit for you. Uh, she is not, now she's relaxed and no, sitting like, right here fine. between us. <laughs> and remember, the Mike Morse Law Firm will pay the standard adoption fees for whoever adopts today's pet of the week right here. It's Destiny. And the Mike Morse Law Firm also wants to help you. If you need legal help, visit their website, 855mikewins.com, or call the same 855-MIKE-WINS to find out if you have a case. Well, Anna, thank you very much for joining us, and thank you for bringing Destiny in. Hopefully, we can get you a new home. Thank you.